Hi Iris. This is your weekly day-by-day -day tarot cards reading by Emma for the week beginning 5th of July 2021. I'm going to draw two cards per day for every day of this week. So, Monday, the 5th of July, 7 of Cups. Tuesday, Justice. Wednesday, the Hermit. Four of Pentacles, Thursday. Friday, the Sun. Saturday, Queen of Swords. And Sunday, with Three of Wands. Your influencing energy is Six of Cups. I'm going to comment on it just now. Monday, Six of Cups with the Tower. Justice. Tuesday with Six of Pentacles, the Hermit with Knight of Pentacles, Four of Pentacles Thursday with King of Wands, the Sun with Judgment Friday, Queen of Swords Saturday with Eight of Wands and Three of Wands with Ten of Cups. Sunday. Your influencing energy is Page of Pentacles. This is energy that comes from earlier period, perhaps somewhere from June, maybe even earlier or so. Um, but it says that you do have that um, youthful energy, very young energies with both of these. Um, Page of Pentacles is a learner, one who does have its goal, Okay, I want to become so-and-so, like that profession, like that person, you know, and works hard to get there, you know, to understand, to go for it, to be that, that what has chosen, you know, to be in its life, that kind of very young energy. And my impression is that you perhaps did have that idea about yourself like in your childhood. Definitely something from, from earlier on, from your childhood. Um, perhaps you were doing the very same things or it was on your mind like you always wanted to be, I don't know, pilot or something. You see what I'm saying? You always wanted something earlier on that was in your childhood. Perhaps you've been doing it as a hobby or you thought about it. Um, something that you really enjoy. This is very, this is six of uh, uh, cups. This, that, that's your fond memories about something from your childhood, from earlier on. That kind of moment from June and we were talking this new goal that you have for you. Something very practical. Now I'm going to follow and be like that person. Okay, as I said, this one is follower. That one is following its dreams. That what has this, this one decided to be computer programmer or pilot or uh, um, cake maker or something. You see what I'm saying? Anything. But this is learned. This is very beginning, very young energy and it is related to something that you used to do, used to think of, used to like. You see what I'm saying? Something like that, that sort of energy. Important for this week as well. Um, no Monday with a Seven of Cups and the Tower. It says that you do have some of your dreams, some of your options, but it's all in your in your mind, all imagination, all your fantasies, all in the clouds. Nothing really that sits on the ground. This seven of cups. Neither of these options or ideas are real. Maybe they do have some kind of possibilities. You know that could be, or that another one couldn't be. You see what I'm saying? We can talk about possibilities, but at this point it seems to me with the tower that what would that what were you dreaming about your life about your options about near future about I don't know maybe even end goals it falls away okay the tower moment you did have illusion about something that's for sure that will come very strongly on Monday you were illusional about some ideas, some situation in your life, some whatever it is, your career, private life, life in general, okay? 
that comes very strongly on Monday 5th of July you will understand that you are delusional that it's never gonna happen that what you thought about your life about another person something like that that's just a realization on Monday now justice with a six of pentacles now we are talking somebody who is a Libra person maybe helping you with something that you already need okay you or person that needing some advice or money or something whatever that you are in need in here this Libra person will help you very much okay and then it could be that this legal system some court case if you used to have, if you did have, or, or right, that is ongoing, perhaps it will resolve in your favor. You will actually, um, I, I don't know, receive some money out of that court case if that was money in question. You see what I'm saying? Could very well be. Something that is legal, something that is institution, some decision, perhaps that will mean money for you court case or something that is from some institution, I don't know, um, some tax payments, repayments, um, tax uh, rebates or something like that, you do have money received from something that is official, okay? Um, and as I said, you might actually be given hand, helping hand from another, but then we are talking person, perhaps Libra, on Tuesday. Now, the Hermit with Knight of Pentacles on Wednesday. Now, we are talking um, again this particularly goal that you have for yourself, something that you have chosen earlier on, you know, last week or somewhere in the June. You see what I'm saying? You have chosen something for yourself, something very practical that you're supposed to do, that's supposed to bring you money. Okay, this is very certain energy, Knight of Pentacles, that is kind of, you know exactly what you're supposed to do. You know how to do it, who you're going to sell it to, okay, and that one will pay you or maybe pays you in advance already. You see what I'm saying? Very straight forward situation no rush very grounded we know all of it you see what I'm saying no mistake with this one but not the hermit energy is that wise one okay that energy is something else and for me that one is always related to something that is difficult I know I've seen these cards I have that in my readings it's never easy energy okay whatever that you do you know that you have to pay full attention to it. Even if you know exactly what you're supposed to do, you have to be very methodical. You mustn't make mistake because if you rush, you will make mistake. This one and this, this one is kind of Virgo energy, methodical, careful. Um, be tolerant with other people. You see what I'm saying? Pay attention every step of the way. It's not easy. It's not easy task. You will complete. Okay, this the hermit energy never miss to complete, to finish, to find solution. You see what I'm saying? Never. That one will do it. But it's not easy road. Okay. You might need to sacrifice something of yourself. Perhaps you need to... You have, you've got your deadline, okay? That is um, something that's supposed to be done, that's easy to be done in two weeks. But now your deadline is another week and you have to rush day and night and you will do it. That says you will do it. And you will complete your, uh, your task. You will complete whatever that you need to do. You'll find solution, whatever solution, if you are searching solution for something. You see what I'm saying? You will, but it's not going to be easy. There will be some kind of difficulties there. Short deadlines or amount of work or something. You see what I'm saying? But you will do. You will do it. Um, both of these energies are very certain. Okay. Actually, this Wednesday, Wednesday um, is beautiful for something that you, that is a concrete job, practical job that will bring you rewards. Do it on this day, even if it's difficult. Wednesday says you will do it no matter what. King of Wands and Four of Pentacles on Thursday. Now, King of Wands is lovely energy. I like this fire energy because it's very creative. That what is on your mind, Aries, that's, also, that's actually your energy. That's Aries or Leo or Sagittarius person, okay? This King of Wands. And once you feel like this one, um, you can recognize your best self, okay? When you are confident, 
um, and you're proud of yourself and you want other people to see you. You pick up attention. You see what I'm saying? With the things that you do, you can do things by yourself. That sort of confidence, that's reliability, that ideas that are doable, nobody can have better ideas and create that situation, that job, like, like this one, this energy is very capable, okay? And you know when you feel like that, capable, confidence, everything you can do by yourself, nothing better for Aries person than that, okay? And Thursday is like that. It seems it might bring some money, okay? But it will be um, not big amount of money. This, is, this isn't enormous amount of money or something extraordinary. This is something that you have expected, okay? And it is a very basic. Um, Four of Pentacles, it's also your safety, your security. It could be that you are working towards that, towards your independence. You need to pay your own bills, to do your own jobs, to, you see what I'm saying, to do things for yourself, by yourself, and you are confident about this, that you can finally pay your own bills, pay your rent, pay your course, you see what I'm saying, that kind of could be for some of you something like that, because this is also being very independent, okay, planning also something for the future and counting how much do you have to invest, because this one is good planner, good creator, I told you, creating something for the future, but then you have to see, do you have enough money, do you have enough knowledge, what do you have, what do you have, what, what values that you have, this is all the valuables or values that you have, including your knowledge, your time, you see what I'm saying, uh, help that you can, that you can count on, or all that is value there that you can go with, that you can count on, that you can invest further, something to create with, could also be something like that on Thursday, but lovely energy, whatever, whatever that is on your mind, in fact, with this four of pentacles, okay, you will be up to that, whatever, ever, whether that you are looking for your independence, or you are receiving small, a small amount of money, or you are, or you are investing, or whatever that you do, with this energy, you can do anything, you can achieve, so these two days are very, um, uh, are very suitable, kind of, for something that is practical, for your planning, for things that you can do, for uh, being confident and feel capable, okay, the things can work your way, you can work with things, you can create, no doubts here at all, Wednesday and Thursday, lovely days. Now, Friday with two majors, sun and judgment. Now, these two sometime um, talk about something that is now or never, and could be that you that you're gonna feel like that on Friday. Things are going well. You are very confident, feeling yourself very capable. Perhaps you will feel that is now your time. On Friday, something will feel like that. Now or never. It's time to win. Time to do it. Must do today. You see what I'm saying? Kind of see your chance for something, okay? For some resolution, for some completion, for some, you know, to nail it. You have to. That that kind of feeling. You see what I'm saying? That you can nail it now. You have to do it now. Now is the chance. Now or never. You see what I'm saying? If I win now, you know, it's... Um, if I don't win now, I will never... I will never... Or if I lose now, it's going to stay like that. Things like that. Seeing that 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 something important that is make or break moment and whatever happens now, it will stay. And you have to push for your victory for something that is positive, for something that is gain, because it will stay. You are pushing for winning position because it's kind of now or never. Now is kind of win or lose. That kind of a moment with these two on Friday kind of urges you to do something like, um, as I said, now or never, or make or break, things like that with these two energies. Very strong, very strong energy on the... Uh, on Friday, and being that you do have very intense, um, very confident energies now, uh, Wednesday and Thursday, 
okay? I think that you are onto something that is that is um, prosperous, that is very prosperous, something that you can do and you do see it, you know, that you can do it. Now is your chance. Perhaps you've got people to help you. Perhaps for some reason you do have a chance now and that chance is not going to last. You have to use it now or things like that. Anyway, Queen of Swords on Saturday with Eight of Wands. Still intensity, okay? Lots of things that you have to do. Follows this energy very well, okay? That kind of now or never. You have to do it now. Now, Eight of Wands is just that. You have to do it. If you, if you don't do it perfectly, now you won't win. You won't gain. You will miss your chance. Something like that. And you are busy. You are not missing your chance, Aries. You are aware of it. And if somebody can do it in the situations like that, is you. Okay? So I really trust that you will be up to your task, particularly particularly that you have Queen of Swords in your environment, that could be person, okay? Also Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, maybe Libra person, I mean, uh, that you have in your environment perhaps because figures now strongly with this ju uh, justice card. But I kind of felt that it is you, that is not just you, but an energy of clarity, okay? On this day, on Saturday, that you will know that's your way. Just do it. Just do it properly. Don't spare yourself. Don't save yourself. Be busy because this is busy. This is intense. This is organizing, um, putting in place, communicating. You see what I'm saying? Many things to put in place and to do it right. This is a must be done, must be communicated, must be sorted out. Things like that. You are not sparing yourself. That's your clarity. That will bring you that winning position. You see what I'm saying? That will put you on the road. Kind of that make or break moment. Not make or break, but uh, now or never moment. You've got some chance. You definitely saw. You definitely have your chance for something. And you do see it and you won't spare yourself. You will work hard. Whatever that you need to do. From early morning till late in the evening. You will. Because there is clarity. That will put you on the right path. That will show you the way. You do understand, in fact, your way. So you're not going to miss out on it. Now, three of wands and ten of cups. It seems to me you will put things together. Okay, this three of wands is just that. New endeavor. You are on to it. You did put things together. Everything is on the ground. Everything is stable. Okay, you've done whatever you needed to do. Even if you do it first time, you've done it bravely. All the time we do have that bravery in here and this person, this one is waiting to see what is going to be, what results this is going to bring. Okay, you are waiting for response, you are waiting for results, you are waiting for money, for rewards, you are waiting to see what is going to have, what is going to be out of that, you know, what, what you have done um, all along these days. And um, just this moment of uh, um, acknowledgement, in fact, that you managed to put things together, okay, being very busy, okay, and, and uh, having this pressure that is important to, be, to do it now, to do it on this day. Otherwise, for some reason, this, this offer or some situation will expire. This opportunity will not stay forever. This is now something to be done these days. Just the, the, the fact, just, the, just that fact that you managed to put together something that is lot, something that is intense, something that was must, okay, makes you very proud, very happy with yourself because you do understand this will be good for you. This will mean happily ever after. This will bring success for, for you. Ten of Cups is seeing. It's not just about today, being happy about today. This one is seeing future as today. That's what you see with, with this Ten of Cups. Future happiness, like today, like in the future. Very nice. So it seems to me that what you have done, that what you put together, makes you very happy because you do see your future with that. Happy future with something that you have done. You use that chance 
properly, you did have chance, you didn't miss it. That is very nice because this Queen of Swords on Saturday is already clear and uh, clarity about the whole situation. Okay, it seems to me you're not going to miss your chance. Something did appear this week and you will use it properly. You won't spare yourself. Enjoy it.